everybody this is Sylvia welcome back to my channel so today I wanted to share with you uh, Michael's haul I haven't been to Michael's in a little while like it's been a while um, that I decided today that I wanted to go get myself some stuff um, they did have some paper pads on sale for 70% 70 70 off plus there was that 20% off between three and five or three and closing I don't know I really didn't read the coupon I was at the store I knew I had a coupon for 20% off everything or anything that I bought but I didn't realize it was till three so I'm walking around the store which gives you a time to look for other stuff which I shouldn't have been looking for but anyways um, if you hear me stop it's because I'm enjoying a Dunkin Donuts coffee that I actually um, gave myself today to buy one because I haven't bought one in a while so I was excited about that um, so let's get started the first paper pad that I got was this one that says hello spring and this one I mean what can I say it's all about spring the the paper that comes in here and I always try to have this open uh, but I haven't done this in a while so bear with me as I try to open these so that I can show you oops I just ripped it dang I hate when I rip it cuz then <sighs> sorry I, I literally just walked in and I wanted to make sure that I made this video so that I can post it up like literally hopefully tonight because I've been a little behind I in videos because I haven't really been doing much but this is the first one hello spring and look at these beautiful pages and this is my problem my problem is that I go and buy stuff and I have so many paper pads oh my goodness look at these butterflies my, anyways going back my problem is that I go and I buy all these paper pads and I haven't worked on any projects and I really want to work on projects with some of these look at this little bunny with some of these paper pads so oh my goodness look at this one oh my god sorry I'm trying to remember which one was the first page so that I don't keep going after that page because as we know, these usually have two pages of the same. Um, and I really want to start working on projects. Like I actually, I actually finally am going to start doing some paper pads um, projects. So my first one is going to be cards. Um, I'm just going to pretty much, here we go. And this is the first page again. So that's this one, the Hello Spring, 48 pages, 12 by 12, and it's by... American crafts I can it show you like how to make a little card and then this little cute bunny here this bunny right here it's it's um sorry let me bring this down a little bit okay so this little bunny it looks like they they cut the papers but they did like little trim on all every single page so that's interesting like a little ruffle type of thing and like I said, these were all like $5.99, I think. Yeah, $5.99. And then I got this other one from uh, the, the Recollections Paper Pad Collection. Uh, this one is Bold Brush Strokes 12 with treatments. I don't know what that means, but there's 40. Oh, maybe um, it means um, this gold, this fo gold foiled stuff on it, maybe. That's why it says 12 with treatments. Uh, there's a total of 48 and then this one says hot by so anyways going back to me talking about like me having to do projects so yeah so that's my first project is gonna be I'm gonna be making card um, card sets um, because I have so many so much paper here we go look at this one this one's really nice so yeah so I'm gonna be working on making card sets and I'm actually going to be posting uh, the sets. Oh, look at this one. I like this one, but tell me, what do you guys do with these? Like, I don't, I mean, I could maybe use this. I'm pretty sure you can frame it, but I, I don't I don't have that much space for me to make making these frames. If you have any ideas on what to do with it, send me a message on Instagram. Um, it's easier for me to see the messages on Instagram because I get them directly on my um 
YouTube, I usually just check them when I go on my computer because I don't think I get, I, I don't, I haven't figured out a way to answer back on my phone. It's kind of weird. I don't know. I don't know if it's just my phone or I haven't figured out the way. But yeah, so I'm going to be doing the cards um, and I will be creating sets. Um, and I don't know, what else do you guys do with paper pads? I mean, aside from, you know, like the regular projects, I really need to just start making some stuff. Look at this paper. This is the reason why I got it. And I know somebody on Instagram that does, the, like she does her own, like she mixes the colors. I, I might be able to do it. I don't know, I've never tried it, but I just don't have the patience to wait for the paper to dry. I'm gonna be real. That's my only thing, my patience. Look, here's another one. This is so cool. Look at this marmalized right here. I would just use this and then I would probably use this for something else. I don't know, but that's really cool. There were some, I don't know if you've seen them, but they have like, they had one also for the, it was like a fall one. Look at these, these are so cool. There is a fall one, but it's like literally like a whole big pumpkin. And I'm like, what would I do with that? If I could do something with it, it would be cool. But I really, I was thinking, I'm like sitting there like, I'm sorry, I'm standing there thinking like, what would I be able to do with this? And it's not the first time that I come across it. Oh, this one is so pretty. Look at this one. Oh, this one is really pretty. So that's, that's the bold brush strokes. 48 sheets from Recollections. This one, I was gonna show you guys this one last, but it just came up right now. And this one it looks like people have already opened it because it was the only one that was there. And you know what, I didn't even check. I didn't even check if it was on sale. I just realized that I probably should have checked, but it was within all the paper pads. So now I'm wondering if it was even on sale because it was the only one. But look at these. Oh my goodness, these are so like antique, retro looking. I think it's more antique, I don't know. And this one is called Close Knit, 48 pages, and I believe American Crafts. Yep, American Crafts, and look at, there's some projects on the back on what you would be able to use this. But, oh my God, I saw it and I was like, I need to buy it. But this is my problem, what am I gonna do with it? It just looks really pretty. But look at this. I don't know. It's just really pretty. I love it. This right here, this is like my my thing. Um my mom had um some of these things in her crafting box. I remember these radios like in my aunt's house. Like when I would go to my aunt's house, like they had old school like really like antique stuff and I remember these radios right there in their house. So that brought memories to me right now. Oh wow, look at this. I don't know if you can see this. It's pretty hard to see, but this tells you like, this is your name right here. This is so cool. This one here tells you your name and then you could put your mom's name, your dad's name, and then your grandparents. This is so cool. Oh my God, this is really cool because I just had a conversation with my dad the other day because we've been connecting more with his family lately since my mom's passing. It's been more, we wanna, uh, I want my dad to, you know, talk to siblings and make sure he hadn't talked to them in years and I wanted him to go ahead and start talking to them again and, you know, seeing how they are because he hadn't talked to them in a long time because they're so far away and we came to the conclusion that my mom's mom passed away when she was really young she must have been like five or six and I don't know anything about her like nothing because my mom really never talked about her so I started telling my dad like we really need to look and see if there's any family on my grandma's side of my mom um, so that triggered that right now that I that's pretty much where I'm at right now. I'm in a journey right now with that and here we go that's a that's restarting again so yeah, so that's something random in conversation that just came up. But it's crazy to me that 
I'm starting to like meet more family because we we have been in the United States for so many years um, and we haven't been able to connect with our family that stayed behind and we are connecting with some of the ones that we hadn't connected in a long time and I have to be honest it's a little overwhelming because I'm not used to so many people being around us um, so I'm having to learn to you know to <laughs> to be okay with so many family reaching out to me through Facebook it's just awkward it's awkward and like I said I'm trying to deal with it I see it as a good thing but then at the same time I'm not used to it so anyways this is a dark rainbow paper pad from recollections and I fell in love with this one this one is so pretty because of the dark colors I um you don't see this this these colors often and there was a black one that I really wanted but they didn't have it and I was really sad but I realized I already bought all these things I'm not gonna go try to search for it uh, this one is again it this one says 12 with treatment so which means like this um, I want to say like the holographic um, effect there's 48 sheets like always and look at this and I have somebody out there that probably loves these um, oh my goodness look at this one oh, this one is so cool um, I have somebody out there that likes these colors that has to do with anything like with the guy and the stars um, so I think she would love it and I you know who you are <laughs> I'm sure that she will watch this video she might already have this paper pad um, but look at this your faith is in your hands right now it's just things are happening in my life that are so beautiful right now that I never expected to happen um, but I'm very happy and that's what's important. I've learned the hard way. Being happy is the most important thing in life. Because money, yes, you might have money, but... Oops. <laughs> um, having money, it's not gonna... One, it might not even help you get a cure to something if you're ill. Um, two... Some people just tend to be around you because that's what they want from you. I'm not saying that's my case. I'm just saying like I've learned that happiness is the best way. Being happy, being healthy, being surrounded by people that really love you. That's what matters. And I, like I said, like that's, that's what matters. That's all I'm going to say about that. But anyways, oh my God, look at this one. This one is really cool. This one is cool too, but then I get back to what do I do with this? I could cut this out and use these. I could totally do that. But yeah, here are the different, um, I always forget what the, the signs. Um, so there's that one. And then this final one, this final one, and I haven't been, God, did I do it on top of I haven't been crafting in a while and I've missed it so badly. But the last few, I want to say the last few weeks I've been so tired. And it's not because I'm like doing a lot. I just, I changed my diet a little bit. So it's kind of affecting me in the sense that I'm getting used to it. So maybe that's what it is. I don't know. Uh, spring po poises? Posies? I don't know. I've never saw that, seen this word before. I'm trying to see if that's the actual title. Bouquets. I don't know. And then there's another word that... <laughs> Anyways, it's a paper pad. And this one looks like very um, spring to me. Possibly even like... No, a spring. Um, and then once again, there's foiled ones and there's 48 sheets. I re this this one I was looking this these two I was looking on the I was looking at them online and um, I was like I want those so I went for sure for these two mm 
This one is really pretty. This one I would definitely frame. There's a couple of butterflies in the colors that it has. It's really beautiful. Gold foiling. Oh, this one is so cool. I totally could see this one working out in um like the in um uh, it could be a planner or and it could also be those um the other type of planners. I forgot what they're called. Oops, I'm opening it up too much. Look at this colors right here. These florals are nice. Oh, this one, they're little tiny butterflies. I know sometimes it's hard to see. I got some new lighting because it was starting to bother me. Look at these. I forgot what these are called, but these are those little things where you can put your plants in. Like the glass one. Oh, wow. Look at this one. This one's like big time garden. This one's really nice. God, these butterflies drive me insane you guys don't even know like we've talked about it before if you watch my videos you know how much I love butterflies I love butterflies right I've, to I've told you guys about that um, so anything butterfly just drives me crazy <gasps> look at this little bunny there are more of these pages oh, I'm skipping one I'll just say one. Have yourself a good time. Really? Like, really? Really? <laughs> oh my goodness. And there, I have other paper pads that have butterflies. But you know, like, I bought two of them because one of them I have to save because, you know, I will probably never find it again. But there it is sitting collecting dust. And I, if, I don't know if you follow uh, Jan's Crazy Life. She does a lot of stuff with paper crafting and there's a lot, a large community um, that um, she works with or she does collabs with. And oh my God, she had been away for a while. You know, like I said, sometimes life happens. And she finally came back not that long ago. And I think it was last week on Sunday, she posted a video of her making something with a paper bag which I'm gonna do um, but I have mine is a little bit different um, find beauty and everything um, and yeah she is back and she has a lot of videos of different things that she does with paper pads at one point she did have a um, uh, she did have uh, it was kind of like a challenge on doing things with only one paper pad and every day you had to do something different which I loved it because I never did it but I used to like watching it because I mean, it inspired me to do stuff but then I still haven't done anything <laughs> anyways I got these flowers these were I believe they were 40% off they're ten dollars but I have a little um, when I left my other job my pretty much my my two supervisors that I had gave me this little vase with these pink flowers because I love um, pink. My whole like desk area was in pink. So they gave me these flowers and I found these today and I was like, hmm, I'm gonna put these, you know, because that little, um, the little vase was so cute and I really love the way that they, they looked. Um, so I'm gonna add this on here. I think they gave me roses. I'm trying to remember, but I believe they gave me roses. And they were actually for my birthday, so. But I wanted to put something in there. Anyways, I told you guys that my project was gonna be to make cards, so I got this. This was the regular price was $16.99 and they were $10, so I got this. And I'm trying to hurry up because my battery's dying. So that never happens to me. Oh. I got these yarns here uh, or ribbons they were uh, originally $3.99 and I wear $1.17 I believe so I got those no specific no specific reason on why I got them I just got them then they had these for 50% off I think they were like one something maybe like uh, sale price 
and they just have like different words which I could totally use on I think this paper pad maybe yeah I think I could use it with this paper pad the one the this one right here so I got two of these and it has a total of 177 so I got that and then I got this for somebody special um, it's gonna be a gift for somebody very special and I just realized that this got all smushed with the stuff I had in it I'm gonna have to fix it but anyways yeah it's for somebody special um, that has been is, has been going through a rough rough time and I think she will definitely enjoy this um, and then I got these little bags so I got these at I'm pretty sure I could have got maybe got them at Dollar Tree but I didn't want to even bother stopping again at another store because that's very dangerous I already had spent all this money there so no so I got these these are the little small uh, like the little mini lunch bags like the brown paper bags but these are small ones uh, because like I said Jan's crazy life posted up a video last Sunday where she's making like a book with these so I'm gonna try to do it with these so anyways that's all that I got this time around thank you guys so much for watching this very long video and have a great day bye